All right, welcome back, everyone, to more Felty Apprentice. Last episode, we were killed by the guard when we fell face first into the archery instructor's bare naked ass. So that was pretty amusing. So I loaded up the last save where we have. This is where the stats were for that. I'm pretty sure this is. Yeah. At the end of the day. This is probably another reason why I like to always save off. This <laughs> is like, yeah. Couldn't make it even all the way to the end because. They, they murdered the shit out of me. Good morning. For a complete accident. Hmm. I reckon. <laughs> yes, thank bye you. Bye bye now. Let's go ahead and give it another save here. And change to our bow and arrow and go. Chit chat. We will let's see North Yard talk Yo! to her. Is that so? Now can I <laughs> skip through this? Yeah. Cause we read that last <laughs> time. I want. To uh. <laughs> All right. <sighs> yeah. We want Till to next time, apprentice. raise up our relationships, and we'll also hmm. talk to you. What do you want? Hmm. Guess <sighs> 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 it's about the same as clicking the auto. Oh, by the way, I like right clicked, and that brought up that menu. <gasps> I mean. Right click and it brings that up. What do you want? Okay, let's save again here. In case we get murdered by things ever. <gasps> Oops. I mean Huh? I wasn't like waiting waiting for you. Uh, probably not. I mean it's probably it's pretty obvious you want to continue your archery training. I was just making sure there was an open station. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. Start training. Ha. Loser. Ha. Yeah, and we're gonna do our right. triple commands again. Yeah, 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 ha. come on. Ha. Loser. Try not to screw up. Okay, right, left, up. Down, up, right. Right, left, up. <gasps> this doesn't make you special. You! <sighs> yeah, we went through this already. Experience this time, apparently, I need to wind. run. Slink away back to the castle. Ha, did you see that? Hey, where did he go? You slink away unnoticed back to the castle. And dexterity has increased. So apparently that whole thing with that messed up scene that we got last time must have increased our dexterity even more because it said we reached the milestone, but we got viciously murdered. What can we do for you? Let's see. Do we have enough? Now we have acquired a number of silk spiders and thought the webbing could help strengthen the castle guard's uniform. <laughs> they produce a strong, stronger webbing than any other spider. Correct. You look pretty good with a bow. Mind helping us out? 
We planned to synthesize a webbing, but... Someone accidentally knocked over the jar holding them, so they all escaped. <laughs> Technically, it was you who knocked it over the jar. Oh, shut up! <laughs> well... If you're... What? Yeah, so you got some wording mistakes again. Well, it's your side of the lab. Oh, no, that is right. Okay, well, if it's uh, using the wrong your again, prob is the problem. Well, if your side of the lab wasn't such a mess, I never would have slipped and fallen. The arguing goes on for a short time, but you find this woman so odd, it's actually kind of entertaining. Anyway, as you can see, the spiders have started building a web in the corner over here. Just watch your step. It's a little cluttered. What? What? We're done for! We've fallen and we can't get up. Oh, here we go with the uh, upskirt shots again, eh? We could use a little help here! Shoot them in this order. Green, red, yellow, blue. Green, red, yellow, blue. This is so gross. Shoot them in this order. Blue, yellow, red, green. Blue, yellow, red, green. Nice shooting. Shoot them in this order. Yellow, red, green, blue. Nice shooting. Silk spiders scatter as you pull the alchemist up from the ground. Alas, we're free of the webbing. Mm -hmm. By our calculations. Mm, yes. Let's get the last of them back in the back in jars. The alchemist rushes off to throwing large glass jars over the remaining silk spiders. What an extraordinary performance, Jolinar. <laughs> the data we collected was wonderful. Our initial projection scans of you were all below average, but it seems you have beaten the odds. All right. We knew there was something special about you. The alchemist moves in close as though she is going to whisper a secret in your ear. <laughs> Please excuse us, we don't have much experience with men. You feel a sudden prick on the other side of your neck before everything goes black. Mm -hmm. By our calculations, mm, yes. You awake to find yourself chained to the alchemist's operating table? Let him go! You can't experiment on Drandall's apprentice. What? We just need a sample. One arm is fine, really. How, how am I supposed to fight for you guys if I'm missing an arm? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We can even replace it with one of our spares. Probably. The marine guard breaks the last chain holding you down. Get out of here, apprentice. I'll hold her off. Not quite. Oh, come on. We just wanted to have a little fun. Completed an urgent I trust quest. everything is in order. I heard you saved the alchemist from almost getting herself killed again. Some of the guard is saying it was luck, but I don't believe in I that. Respect that. You showed character, and I respect that. Normally, I would do the castle rounds myself and get a report from each of the guards. But since the commander had to leave on urgent business, I need... Oversee preparations for the final battle. Mm. There has been an ill wind in the air, and you never know when vaults will send more goblin assassins. I'm assigning you to do the castle rounds for me. Gathering jaws require key items found elsewhere in the castle. Very yeah. well. Good. Make your way around the castle and make contact with each guard. Mm. That doesn't mean chit-chat or distract them from duty 
Once you have received a report from each guard, come back to me here in the lower courtyard. Vaults hasn't crossed the sea towards us yet, so there shouldn't be any urgent news to report. But that doesn't mean we can let our defenses down. Move out. Any questions? Good. Then get to it, soldier. That's an order. One moment, please. No, oh, I unfortunately have like bad problems with my allergies, with constant nasal drainage, and nobody wants to hear that god awful noise, especially with a microphone all up in my face. You approach the doll guard and ask her to report. Instead of opening her scroll like usual, she thrusts her fist forward with her thumb pointing upwards. Okay. Well, let's give the game a save. The hidden forest has been quiet. Too quiet. I have nothing to report, but the animals must sense trouble approaching. Let's go to the... Okay, lower court here is where we just were at. Okay, how about west gate? That's pretty creepy. Let's <laughs> save a lot. I've been collecting lumber from the forest edge to reinforce the gates. Progress is going slower than we thought, but something behind you catches the orc guard's eye. I could have sworn I saw a moving shadow just now. Anyway, we'll get ready to close the gates. It's going to get dark soon. You can tell the first guard nothing to report. Except this creepy person. Oh, it's the person from the start of the game. The closer you get to this mysterious person, the more darkness clouds the edge of your vision. It's you, the girl from my dream. You can actually see me, yes? <laughs> You're kind of cool looking. Are you, are you some kind of dark elf? <laughs> oh, whoa, well, yeah, she is. I didn't even notice that I was looking at her skin. Looks like I was right to choose you after all. You are right here just like Durandal told me you would be. Goddess. And now you will help me into the castle. With a graceful and silent movement, the mysterious dark elf steps into your personal mm. space. The orc that guards the west gate. You see her over there, yes? Why don't you... Why don't you two remove her for me? Now. Uh, now attack her. Normally I would never hit a lady. But I can't let you into that castle. Disappointing. You intend to defend Star's Reach, yes? <laughs> Trusting... Th er, thrusting blindly because they put a roof over your head? Nope, that is trusting blind me because they put a roof over your head. I have other allies within the castle walls. Perhaps one of the instructors, yes? There are many who await the Sorcerer King's arrival. Ouch! The stark magic around her hurts. Pathetic. How will you stand against vaults if you cannot even stand against me? <laughs> If I can find a pattern to this dark magic protecting her and shoot it, then she'll be open for an attack. Up, right, left. Oh my god, that's really freaking holy crap loud. Sorry if that murders the hell out of your guys' ears. Okay, left, right, up. Down, left, right. Up, 
right, left. God, that is horrible. You guys need to um, tone back on the uh, sound effects, especially when we have no volume control options. Left, right, up. Arrow strike. <laughs> it didn't work. Yes. So don't worry, Jelenar. We'll be together very soon. You can trust me on that. Unlike some people in this castle, I would never lie to you. She leans in as you realize you are completely paralyzed. She's so hot, I can't move. I be a good boy and keep this little meeting a secret until then, yes? The scent of lavender fills your nose as she moves within inches of your mm. face. I promise to give you the reward you most deeply seek. She moves her lips to within microns of yours. <laughs> With a torrent of rushing air, the girl sweeps past you. Quickly turning around, you see her jump from the bridge onto the tree and over the castle wall. Black cloth trails behind her like the shadow of a flame. Can the guards not see her? Hey, what's this? We have a tamed black cloth. This item can be equipped in your room. That was definitely unusual. I should report this to the first guard. Yeah, that was that was mighty weird. I'm gonna save that in an empty slot just because that was a very strange encounter. It looks like the ram guard is asleep. I guess that means nothing to report. Yeah, I'm always sneaking up on you. I already reported my hair problem to the first guard. Oh, you met my report for the day. Sorry about that. Nothing to report other than this crazy mad scientist lady. By the power of Atlantis, get me out of here. I guess that's a normal report for the alchemist hour. <clears throat> I should continue making the castle rounds. You approach the goth guards, you see her zone out, mutter to herself as usual. Night rain, night pain. One more night, I'll go insane. That was cool, maybe I should go crazy. I wonder what the first guard would do if I just, like, screamed. Nothing to report from the prison tower. You decide it's probably better to just walk away before she notices you. <laughs> Yeah, probably. It's been really busy here in the archery range. There was three wood pigeons and one blackbird. Oh wait, the first guard told me not to report that kind of stuff. I guess nothing to report here then. You are a strange, strange little lady. The time for us to burn has not come yet. The cinder guard continues to stare at you with her unblinking golden eyes. Uh, okay, thanks for the report. I should just keep moving. <laughs> have you felt anything strange? My horn has been tingling all day. I don't have anything to report, but I can't shake this feeling something terrible is about to happen. Stay magical and happy, Jolinar. I'm sure it's nothing. Your horn's probably tingling because of that creepy dark elf lady. It appears no one is in the mage tower. I don't know what I was expecting coming here to get a report. Welcome back! 
Look at you moving up in the castle. The first guard usually doesn't accept help from anyone. <laughs> she must really like you, Tihi. Or maybe you're just trying to make a little bunny girl like myself jealous. Oh, don't be shy now, you hear? No need to blush, I'm just playing with you, sugar. You go on and tell the first guard there's nothing to report here at the South go Tower. Go get him! Alright, I think that was everything. Alright, I talked to her. Good work, soldier. Ah, I see you have finished the castle rounds. Then report. When you have information that others do not, you may be presented with the option to lie or withhold information. Ah, uh, so let's... We'll save over our main one. Stealth, huh? Stealth probably in, in increase our stealth. Let's go ahead and say nothing to report. We don't have enough stealth. Ah, okay. There's an intruder. I tried to stop her on the bridge, but she escaped and went over the castle walls. This black cloth was the only thing left behind. The first guard inspects the symbols and markings that cover the black cloth. What? This cloth marks a follower of bolts. Move out! Guards, sound the alert. Stay in your room until we have apprehended the intruder. No one is going in or out of Star's Reach tonight. That's an order! The first guard returns the black cloth to you and begins organizing search parties to find the intruder. Welcome back! I wonder if putting that on would... I thought I could equip it from here. Oops. Well, that's probably what it is though, but I can't actually equip it, I guess. That's a little weird that you can actually go back and look at that again and again. Hey there, sugar I don't even know what I just clicked then. Go get him! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not reading this, but um. Oh, maybe I did actually click the oh. No. <laughs> Go get I don't know about that. Bye bye oh. now. Okay, well... I think we're gonna wrap this episode up here. I know it's a little shorter, but... My ears are really hurting again. I got, really need to get into the doctor to figure out what is going on with my ears. And, you know, uncomfortable headset does not help that any either. And it is after two in the morning, so probably going to wrap up the recording for the night. So thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.